everyone! Last Monday I went to the Sylvanian family shop in London and here's what I got. So I got something that's really special and that is the wild boar family. So it says that they are a display sample from 2005 and whilst I was at the shop, Rocky told me that these are actually really special because with the babies, they, this was like a prototype, so the babies are actually wearing different coloured clothes to what they are normally. So the standing baby is wearing yellow, and then the sitting baby is in pink, and the crawling baby is in blue. But when this family was actually released, they were wearing different colours. So I think that is really special and there was only three of this family with the babies wearing those colours released. So this was one of three. So this is super, super rare. So it's definitely the rarest thing I have in my collection. It's so special. So let's see what else I've got. I got the baby duo Undersea Friends. And this was the one thing I knew for sure that I was going to get when I went there. I knew this was the thing. I'd look on their website before and I thought this is the thing that I really want that I should definitely get. Because I'd been waiting to get this because I thought I can get it when I actually go. Otherwise I would have ordered it online but I thought I'll wait and get this when I went. They are so cute. I love their costumes. They're adorable. I think I might have them at the seaside as they're dressed up as like sea creatures but I do think that I'll also have them at baby mermaid castle when I get that and we've also got another costume set the veggie babies so they're really cute I didn't get them before because I don't know I wasn't too sure about them I thought I have quite a few costume babies but then when I saw them in real life, in person, I just had to get them. They're so cute. And I think these would be really good to have on my farm at the market. They could be trying to get people to buy more vegetables. Let's see what else I've got. So I got the tableware set. Just because I thought, well it's something I haven't got and that it's quite a nice little set to have so when they've got like their dining room tables so they actually have something on it just to make it look more realistic like they have things all set up in their houses and then i also got i do already have this but i've got another one of the garden decoration set so at the moment i have the one i have already is set up at the fieldview mill so I thought, and normally before that I had it set up on Beechwood Hall or um, Country Homes so I thought I'll keep that one permanently set up at Fieldview Mill and then this one I can use on another house. And then we have one more Sylvanian thing and that is an address and birthday book. It was only 25p so I had to get it. So you've just got little pictures inside where you've got like a little picture of like a Sylvanian face. So there you'd write the name and then an envelope so you'd write the address, a phone, so you'd write the phone number and then birthday. And there's actually quite a few pages. I thought what I might use this for is I might actually just fill it in with the families and then which house they live at in my Sylvanian village so then I know who's going to live permanently in each house like I know the cows live at Fieldview Mill so yeah I thought that'd be cool to fill it in like that and I can make up little phone numbers and birthday I know the birthdays if I look them up on the internet but I can make up little phone numbers for them as well so I thought this was really cool and for only 25p I just had to have it because even if I don't use it it's just cute <laughs> and then lastly I got some Dolls House Boutique stuff so I've got a rug. I already had a few rugs, but this one is quite a bit bigger. I think it was better to go in the shop to see the Dolls House Boutique stuff because you can actually see 
how big they are, it's easier to see them when they're in front of you rather than trying to imagine the actual size. When you see it like that, I thought yeah, that will be good. And I think I will put it in Country Cottage. I think quite a lot of the Dollhouse Boutique stuff I am going to use in Country Cottage. And then I got this, which I really love. This little like China tea set. I think it's called Pink Rose Tea Set. It's got like teapot, saucers, cups, plates. It's really sweet. I got a copper cooking pot and again I think I'm going to put that in Country Cottage as well because it's all got like that kind of old style that I think would suit that house well and I've got this floral jug and bowl which again that matches the tea set so I thought that would look good in that house as well and then I just had to get these they're so cute the little jars of sweets not sure where I'm going to put them yet, but may, I might put them in the house or possibly just in the sweet shop. But yeah, they are really cute. But in Country Cottage, there is a shelf on the wall, so I wondered if these would fit on that shelf, then I might put them in there. And then the wild boars can have a sweet tooth. And then we've also got some pans, copper pans, there's three in there, different sizes. Again, to go with the cu the cooking pot to go in Country Cottage. And then lastly, this is the last thing, and that is this cute little shopping basket, which I thought could be good for Easter, because it's a nice like wicker basket, or to use shopping, and it's just really cute. And then that is everything. And I'm so happy that I have one of these bags now. I'm sure I probably do have some somewhere else. I'm not sure where, probably somewhere in this room, but yes, I do love the bag, so I keep that in here, I put it on my door. Now I'll show you it all close up. So here it all is. I just love the jars of the sweets. They're just so adorable. The Undersea Friends, so we've got a Mole and a Labrador. The Veggie Babies, we have, I think is it a Beaver, a Mouse and a Rabbit. And I think the Rug is the perfect size. Because if you see the family, they can literally just lay all on the rug together. So I think that's a great size for to have like underneath a dining room table or in the living room and it's good to have another one of these so I can have it set up on another house at the same time as it being over here on Fieldview Mill and then all of these little miniatures are just so adorable and I think I think they'll look really good once I have them all set up in Country Cottage with Balcony, which is where the wild boars are going to live. They are just so special. I just can't believe it. It was a family that I didn't know I wanted until I saw them. Because I guess I thought it was one that I never thought I'd be able to get. But then I just saw them and I was like, wow, I need them. Whatever the price is, I need them. And I picked them up and saw they're only $49.99. And I thought, wow, that is amazing. So I thought I'd definitely have to get those. And they just look so cute. I'm just so happy with it all. So I'd just like to say thank you to Rocky for telling me about these wild boars. Otherwise I wouldn't have known that they were so like super rare and special that there was only three of those with the babies wearing those colours. That's just so special. So thank you so much for telling me about those and for being so helpful and friendly whilst I was at the shop. So in my next videos, there'll be some unboxings and also a setup for the country cottage. So I'm really excited to make those and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.